Welcome back friends and thanks for watching. Yes, you read this correctly. I will no longer use Guardian of Truth and Jack Spanner as my go-to officer pairing for my main battle tank because there is a new sheriff in town with her deputy, Lady Justice and Valkyrie. I will phase out those two officers as soon as I fully awaken Professor Payne and level him until level 60, then I will immediately fully awaken Lady Justice after I've done some testing with my fellow teammate from HBR. I concluded that this popular pairing, Spanner and Guardian, is no longer relevant they are still good but as for a main fighting unit there is much better and you know the best thing you don't need the pockets to unlock those two officers as long as you are playing this game uh, for 300 days you will be able to unlock lady justice as for valkyrie she only require 180 days to uh, claim. Before I share the test result with you with the upcoming footage, let's talk a little bit about Justice. I'm not going to go over her stats again. You can uh, see this on your own time and if you want to compare all the officers, remember that I've made a spreadsheet with all the ground officers so you can compare on one page all their skills and um, choose the best pairing for your fighting unit. As for Lady Justice and Valkyrie, they are ideal for a main battle tank. I'm talking about main battle tank, it can be also a light tank or a helicopter. Why the main battle tank and not the medium or the heavy tank? By the time you can unlock Lady Justice, you should have a main battle tank, a modern unit. All I can say for now, well, Lady Justice, she is versatile. She will work with any unit, tank or artillery. I believe she works best with a fast tank, either MBT or a light tank, as she got similar um, attribute as Winter Huntsman. And if you love Winter Huntsman, you will appreciate Lady Justice. She's just like Winter Huntsman, but better and stronger. As for Valkyrie, she is a tank specialist. If you want to benefit her full skills, you will need to assign her as the leader of a tank unit. She doesn't have to be leading the troop. She could be either a commander or a nade. Uh, she will get, um, she's pretty strong and she got that sundered armor which reduced her damage resist by 20%. Uh, there's a 40% chance to get hit with this skill and you will see in the footage the special effect. That's when you know you get hit by her um, skill. In the upcoming footage, you uh, we will conduct four tests. The first pairing is Spanner and Guardian, the combo that you already know. Then we're going to try Spanner with Lady Justice, then Spanner with Valkyrie, and finally Valkyrie with Lady Justice. He will go against my unit, which is a tank of about the same power. And on my officer pairing is Guardian of Truth and Professor Payne. As of this video, Professor Payne is not fully awakened. I still need around 340 statue to fully awaken him. But regardless, it doesn't matter. The, the effect is still the same. You will see a a clear advantage with the latter officer pairing and you can make your own conclusion i can tell you right now valkyrie and lady justice it's the new officer combo to get so without further ado let's roll up the footage and i will comment every round stay tuned guys so first round same officers the difference is I have Professor Payne and he doesn't. So we have Jack Spanner and Guardian of Truth. I have Guardian of Truth and Professor Payne. Each unit are quite similar. The difference is mainly officers right there. But I know it's hard to compare equal units, but it doesn't matter because on the battlefield, 
you don't know what to attack you don't know what to expect right so this is just to get a baseline as a reference as a benchmark and i will show you the battle report and the damage dealt so you draw your own conclusion right so i will be the victor on this round easy victory so we're almost done So his unit dealt 13 million damage, his officer 8.17 million, and he suffered almost 70 million. This is our benchmark. So you will see my battle report. I lost three units. Second round, Spanner and Justice. Here we go. I still score some penetration shots. That gives me a bonus. already lost one unit but no big deal he lost a little bit more and he's dropping faster now i lost three units already i lost four units okay so will i lose one more unit i don't think so not that as with this power level so all in all i lost four units this time with lady justice instead of guardian of truth let's see his battle report is unit dealt 16.2 million uh, officer damage 8.88 he suffered 67.7 so better performance this time so far this is the best combo third round spanner and valkyrie both are fully awakened. So you see the southern armor um, damage he's dealing to me. I still have some penetration shots. Now this round, hmm, I don't know. His HP is dropping quite fast. I only lost three units so far and as mm -hmm. With this current HP, I don't think he's gonna kill an additional unit. So yeah, I only lost three units so far. Let's see the numbers. Okay, quite disappointing. Pretty similar as the first round with Spanner and Guardian of Truth. Let's see my battle report. Okay, yeah, I lost three units. So now, we're gonna try lady justice and valkyrie and let's see how it goes round four fight now i already lost one unit two unit three units so I'm dropping HP quite faster now and I don't see much penetration. Oh, it's getting close. I'm still the victor there, but now you can see the difference with this combo. He's quite stronger. Yep. Oh, yeah, clearly the difference. 16.4 million, 21.8 million of officer dealt damage. Officer damage dealt, sorry. Wow, that's quite a lot. So there you have it, guys. You see the difference with those two officers. The latest round is the best one so far. I mean, in terms of officer damage, quite a difference at least. Uh, twice as much even a little bit more than twice as much damage i don't know if it's a, a random, random thing because the southern armor um, skill there's a 40 percent it's not guaranteed you can get uh, very few or you can get quite a lot it really depends it's totally random but still uh, the result are the results are quite impressive and as you can see, I mean, this is by far the best 
pairing yet so like i said um as far as i'm concerned this is a, a winning combination so that's why i will gradually phase out guardian of truth and spanner to replace them with um, professor Payne and most likely lady justice and i can't wait to share the results with you as very few commanders have this officer but this is not about professor Payne. this is about lady justice and valkyrie two officer far from being out of reach because they can be unlocked as long as you've been playing this game for quite a while now and uh, even if by then you have enough statues to awake them maybe there will be even better officer available you see the pattern here every new officers are stronger than before that's good news for you anyways guys that's it for today i hope that this video helped you uh, if it did give me a thumbs up it will help other players reach out and make the right decision in terms of office repairing until then guys i'm gonna wish you a, a good week and i see you until the next video